Are you ready to seize the opportunity with FactSet Research Systems stock? Get ready to delve deeper into FactSet Research Systems. Our initial report hit our website on Tuesday, September 26, 2023, and now we're back with an even more comprehensive analysis just for you. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and turn on notifications to stay updated on the latest insights. Missing out on crucial updates that could impact your investments is not an option. Supercharge your trading decisions with our groundbreaking AI stock analysis tool, powered by GPT-4, available at stockinvest.us. Tap into the immense power of artificial intelligence and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide today. Remember, this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered financial advice. Hey there! Today, we're diving into the latest rankings of FactSet Research Systems as a buy candidate. Our system has given it a score of 1.64 since September 22, 2023. But here's the thing, the stock's performance during this period hasn't been quite what we expected. It's actually recorded a loss of minus 0.86% so far. That means on average, it's been experiencing a daily loss of minus 0.29% since it was listed as a buy candidate. Let's see what's been going on. Are you curious about the stock market? Well, let me tell you some interesting insights about this particular stock. It's currently in the middle of a weak rising trend in the short term, and there are indications that it will continue to rise. Exciting, right? Now, let's talk about the potential changes in the next three months. Based on the current trend, there's a possibility of a 7.37% change. That means you could see a return between 3.14% and 12.13%. That's quite promising. Looking ahead to the 12-month trend, things get even more intriguing. It suggests a minus 0.595% change, which might sound discouraging at first. But wait, there's more. There's also a potential return between minus 11.75% and 8.16%. This means that after a year, the stock price could range from $381.34 to $467.33. Isn't that fascinating? Welcome to our daily update for FactSet Research Systems. Today's headline reads, Exciting news, FactSet Research Systems Inc. stock price shows stronger technical forecast after Tuesday trading. Let's dive into the details. On Tuesday, September 26, 2023, the FactSet Research Systems Inc. stock price experienced a slight decline of minus 1.12%. It went from $436.97 to $432.09. However, don't be discouraged. Throughout the trading day, the stock showed a fluctuation of 1.26%, reaching a day low of $431.96 and a day high of $437.41. It's important to note that the stock has been on the rise in 6 out of the last 10 days, with an impressive increase of 2.02% over the past 2 weeks. Additionally, we observed a positive sign as the trading volume declined along with the stock, indicating a potentially promising trend. The volume decreased by minus 12,000 shares, while a total of 251,000 shares were bought and sold, amounting to approximately $108.55 million. Let's zoom out and take a broader look. Over the past 52 weeks, the FactSet Research System stock has reached a high of $474.13 and a low of $377.89. Currently, the price stands at an enticing 8.87% below the 52-week high, which is equivalent to $42.04. Furthermore, it's worth noting that the stock is 12.78% below its all-time high, which was achieved on December 29, 2021, when the price soared to $495.40. Exciting possibilities lie ahead. Exciting Analyst Ratings Update Brace yourself for the latest news on FDS ratings. Just recently, on Friday, September 22, 2023, BMO Capital gave FDS a perform grade with a hold action. But wait, that's not all. Goldman Sachs also weighed in with a surprising sell, grade and a hold action. Now, let's rewind a bit. 
On Thursday, September 21, 2023, BMO Capital had another say, this time with a market perform grade and a hold action. Hold on tight because Barclays just made a noteworthy move, giving FDS an overweight grade with a hold action. And the surprises keep coming. Deutsche Bank recently granted FDS a buy grade with a hold action. Get ready for some exciting news. Factset Research System stock has received an incredible strong buy rating from analysts. That's not all. The P-E ratio and price to book both have been rated as strong buy. This means the stock is a promising investment opportunity. However, when it comes to return on investment, the analysts have given a more cautious, neutral rating. It's important to consider this aspect before making any decisions. Ladies and gentlemen, get ready for some exciting news about FactSet Research Systems. Brace yourselves, because the stock of FactSet Research Systems Inc. is showing some incredible buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages. This means we have a positive forecast for the stock. But wait, there's more. The short-term average is even above the long-term average, giving us a clear indication to buy. We might experience some support from the lines at $430.13 and $429.41 in case of downward corrections. However, if the stock breaks below these levels, it's time to sell. Now, let's talk about the negative signals. They may have an impact on the near short-term development, as a sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Thursday, August 24, 2023, causing a 1.9% fall. Brace yourselves, because we might experience a further fall until a new bottom pivot has been found. But that's not all. The three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD, is currently indicating a sell signal. However, there's a glimmer of hope, as the volume fell together with the price during the last trading day, reducing the overall risk. Isn't that exciting? Hold on to your seats, because we have some exceptional news for you. On Thursday, September 21, 2023, the stock had a golden star signal for the short term. And that's not all. We also have a golden star signal for the medium term dated Monday, November 7, 2022. Now, let me tell you why this is so special. A golden star signal occurs when the short-term moving average, the long-term moving average, and the price line meet in a rare combination. And guess what? This combination often leads to long and strong gains for the stock. Can you feel the excitement building up? Welcome, fellow investors. Get ready to uncover some intriguing signals in the market. Let's dive right in and explore these fascinating indicators. Brace yourself for the moving average convergence divergence, signaling a remarkable sell opportunity. Pivots have also indicated a sell signal a remarkable 23 days ago. On the other hand, Bollinger Bands are favoring a buy signal, which emerged 23 days ago. The short-term moving average is showing a buy signal that emerged just four days ago. Similarly, the long-term moving average is also indicating a buy signal that emerged four days ago. Now, let's examine the intriguing relationship between the short and long moving averages. It revealed a buy signal just three days ago. Moving on, analyzing the 12-month chart allows us to uncover even more enticing signals. The short moving average exhibits a buy signal that emerged four days ago. Likewise, the long-term moving average has flashed a buy signal 54 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages points towards a buy signal that emerged 47 days ago. If you're hungry for more signals, head over to our page at stockinvest.us. Get ready to dive into the world of fact set research systems, where support, risk, and stop loss strategies come into play. Brace yourself as we uncover the hidden gems of this company. FactSet Research Systems Inc. has discovered a solid support level at $426.76, where a potential buying opportunity awaits. This support level has shown its strength through accumulated volume, suggesting an upwards reaction when put to the test. What's fascinating about this stock is its controlled movements and good liquidity, which ultimately translates to a lower risk level. Let's take a closer look at recent trends. In just one day, the stock experienced a price range of $5.45, equivalent to a 1.26% fluctuation. Meanwhile, over the past week, the stock has shown an average daily volatility of 3.15%.
Welcome, fellow traders. Today, we're going to dive into the exciting world of fact set research systems and explore some potential trading levels. But before we get started, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data that you need to know. First up, we have the price to earnings ratio, also known as the P-E ratio. This ratio is a key measure of a company's current share price compared to its per share earnings. It gives us insights into the company's valuation and growth potential. Now, let me tell you something interesting. Factset Research Systems has a relatively normal P-E ratio, which is often observed in businesses with a long track record or predictable revenues. This stability can be a good sign for investors looking for consistent returns. But wait, there's more. When we compare Factset Research Systems' P-E ratio with the industry average, we can truly gauge its potential. It's like comparing a race car to its competitors. Are you ready for the excitement? Now, let's shift our focus to the upcoming earnings report for Q3 2023, scheduled to be released on December 18, 2023. This is an important date to mark on your calendars, folks. Get this, analysts' consensus estimates for the upcoming report are set at $4.12. This figure can have a significant impact on the stock prices, making it a vital piece of information for smart traders like you. Welcome back, traders. Today, we're going to dive into some exciting day trading levels for FactSet Research Systems. Picture this, an upward trend. As the stock climbs higher, keep an eye on the first resistance level at $434.10. If you're not already in the game, wait for this level to be conquered before making your move. But hey, if you're already in, consider this your chance to swing trade and capitalize on the momentum. Now, let's talk about the downside. Brace yourself for the first support level at $426.76. If this level holds strong, it could be your golden ticket to enter at a prime moment and ride the anticipated rebound. Are you ready to uncover some insider trading secrets? Well, you're in for a treat because we've got some exciting information about fact set research systems. But first, let's talk about the ratings. Brace yourself, because the combined average rating for fact set research systems from multiple analyst sources is a strong buy. Now, let's dive into the juicy details of recent insider trades. Picture this, on September 1, 2023, Snow Frederick Phillip made a bold move by conducting an insider sell of 3,000 shares of employee stock option. What could be the reason behind this unexpected move? But wait, there's more. On the same day, Snow Frederick Phillip surprised everyone again by conducting an insider buy of 3,000 shares of common stock. What's the strategy behind these contrasting moves? And the plot thickens. On September 1, 2023, Snow Frederick Phillip made yet another move by conducting an insider sell of 3,000 shares of common stock. What could be the motive behind this intriguing decision? Now, let's shift our focus to another insider. On August 1, 2023, Harding Katrina surprised everyone with an insider buy of 1520 shares of common stock. What's the story behind this unexpected purchase? And last but not least, on August 1, 2023, Moskov Gregory T. left everyone puzzled with an insider sell of 7 shares of common stock. What could be the reason behind this curious move? Now, let's analyze the bigger picture. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be positive with a ratio of 5.474. This indicates a potential advantage for insiders. Brace yourself for some mind-blowing numbers, insiders purchased a whopping 94,264 shares and sold 74,027 shares in the last 100 trades. That's a lot of action happening behind the scenes. Are you ready to make a smart investment move? Well, we've got just the stock for you. Introducing a stock with low daily movements, which means low risk for you. And guess what? We've got a sell signal from a pivot top that was found just 22 days ago. But wait, there's more. We've set our recommended stop loss at $414.65, ensuring a minus 4.04% safety net for your investment. Now, isn't that reassuring? 
Wondering if FactSet Research System stock is worth buying? Well, let me tell you, there are some exciting signals in the short term that suggest a potential buying opportunity for FactSet Research Systems Incorporated. The overall trend looks promising, and we've even upgraded our analysis conclusion from a hold slash accumulate to a buy candidate. But wait, there's more. Our systems have analyzed the volatility and movements of the stock and have found that the current price is undervalued. Now, let's talk about trading on Wednesday, September 27th. We are expecting facts at research systems to open up with a gain of $1.73, starting at $433.82. Before we dive into the exciting world of trading, let's address an important reminder. Trading is a thrilling venture, but it also comes with a high risk of losing money. To ensure you make informed decisions, it's essential to consult a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. Remember, StockInvest.us provides valuable information, but it should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By using this information, you acknowledge and accept full responsibility for your own investment decisions. Now, let's embark on this thrilling journey together. Hey there, stock enthusiasts. Get ready to dive into our current view of the stock. We want to hear your opinion too, so don't forget to comment below and share your thoughts. What's your target for this stock? We can't wait to find out. And hey, if you enjoy this content, make sure to like and subscribe for more exciting updates. Wishing you nothing but successful trading and a truly beautiful day from all of us here at Stock Invest.